So let me get this straight. If a guy holds the door open for me because I'm a woman, that's benevolently sexist. But if he hires me because I'm a woman, that's affirmative action. <laughs> My name is Davison. Welcome to The Big Question, where I ask you one big question daily based on trending media. So today it's all about benevolent sexism. Well, I'm sure you're familiar with regular old malevolent or hostile sexism, as they term it in this article, which is like women can't be scientists or women aren't as strong as men, stuff like that. But what benevolent sexism is, according to Professor Hall from Northeastern University, Benevolent sexism is like a wolf in sheep's clothing that perpetuates support for gender inequality among women. The supposed gestures of good faith, which include, and I will read out the list now, holding doors open for women, calling women love or dear, refusing to split a bill, offering women jackets if women look cold, and saying good women should be put on a pedestal, and finally saying men should make sacrifices to provide for women, all of these things force women to accept the status quo in society because sexism literally looks welcoming, appealing, and harmless, but it's not. And this kind of like, boom, blew my mind because basically, basically she's saying that to be kind and to be nice towards women as a man is a very gendered act and almost like a way to degrade the woman and imply that she's helpless even if his intention is merely to be kind. I had a really good friend point this out today. We need to you know, think about these things in terms of their intent and on an individual basis. If a dude is really nice, then this isn't him being sexist. He just wants to help people. It, it probably has nothing to do with whether or not you're female. And if, for instance, the opposite occurs and he's a guy who's like all women should just stay at home and rear kids and he opens the door for you. Yeah, I, I suppose that is a sign that he is a jerk who sees himself as superior to women, but that is usually not the case. And I certainly don't want to live in a society where they start saying that being kind to women intentionally if you're a man is problematic and indicates that you don't see women as equals. That's absolutely positively ridiculous. All this benevolent sexism stuff makes me think, are there people that believe that a truly equal society is 100% individualistic and self-serving? You should stamp out negative ideology towards women, not positive behavior. So according to this article, and by the way, I found it in the Daily Mail, they say that critics have argued that there's nothing wrong with men trying to protect women as they are usually physically stronger than women. So of course, I kind of disagree with that point because men aren't always physically stronger than women. Think of Ronda Rousey, a famous martial artist. She's definitely stronger than a lot of men who are even slightly larger than her. It should more be that not all acts of kindness are intended to suppress, degrade, or diminish. We are a society that is interdependent and we should help each other and care about each other and not be so analytical about things that may be totally innocuous unless there's intent that is negative behind them. So the big question for today is, because I've talked long enough, this is about you guys now. Do you believe that acts such as opening the door for a woman or helping a woman across the street are benevolently sexist? Or do you think that they're just guys being nice? So my name is Davis and I will be back tomorrow with another big question about trending media. I would hold the door open for you. I don't care who you are, man, woman, alien.